15. Now, there is a local volleyball team making history for their school. Yeah, Lisa Ortiz is meeting those girls this morning who have now won dozens yes. of straight sets. Love that. Yes. And you know what? Uh, I believe it because let me tell you, uh, they have been playing with this volleyball the entire time you guys were talking. I was like, girls, you got to keep going. I need you for like another oh, five minutes sorry. to play this volleyball. The entire time that John was eating, they were yeah. playing. They're like, oh, Hang on, let me grab a bite I know. I'm like, can we stop talking about yogurt, please? Because these <laughs> girls are still trying to do this. All right, here we go. As you mentioned, they are making history undefeated, and I can see why because they're pretty awesome, athletic young ladies. We're at Chilton Middle School here, so this is the eighth grade team. As you mentioned, dozens of games all right so to break it down I've got my two captains with us this morning I've got Ava and Mia good morning to you good morning okay so uh, you guys just finished off a pretty impressive season you went undefeated but even more uh, even bigger than that is you didn't lose not one set right can you explain that to us so basically in volleyball we play to three sets and it's if you win the first set then you play another, and if you lose that set, then you have to play to a third, and whoever wins. So you the third often wins. see people go three sets. Yes. But that didn't happen for you guys. Yeah, no. They did not lose not one set, so they never played that third set, you guys. They literally did 24 sets, not losing, not one, so you went undefeated for the entire season. Correct. That is awesome. All right, we're going to let you in on a little secret. These girls, oh. <laughs> <laughs> They're like, don't forget to tell them what, the, what you were supposed to. Uh, you guys also, you got a lot of girls here, not only play for the school team, but you also play outside of the school. Yeah, we do. We all play for club, yeah. and three of us, or four of us, I believe, we play on a national team, so oh. that's uh, pretty impressive. How long have you been playing volleyball? I've been playing for three years oh, now. three years. Okay. So talk a little about the vibe on this team and how well you guys obviously mesh. Well, like, we all work really hard together, and, yeah. like, we all, like, flow really well. We all have this, like, great connection, yeah. and I have a lot of fun playing with all the girls yeah. on our team. During the season, as this is happening, as you start to see that you are winning match after match after match, did you get an idea? Was it like, oh, my gosh, we could, because this is history for the school, right? So did it, could you get that sense that this was happening? I mean, like, I didn't really realize that yeah. we were like going to do this well. Yeah. But I knew we were going to do well, but the fact that we worked like really well together yeah. to win all the games, it was very impressive. Yeah. And what was the reaction from schools when you guys would show up? Um, a lot of them were like, especially in the beginning, we weren't the school that was supposed to win. Yeah. We were kind of the underdog. But when we started winning more and more and we finally beat the team that won last year, a oh. lot of people started being like, Oh, wow, that's the team who yeah. beat Granite Oaks, so yeah. <laughs> that's the team that beat Granite Oaks. Yeah. So all right, so you guys are eighth graders here, so you guys are the big fish here, right? And then after here, where do you guys all go? We go to West Park High School. Okay, and so you all trying out for volleyball there? Um, I believe so, I yeah. I believe so, okay, pretty impressive. I mean, they're still going. They're still going, you guys. <laughs> Should we see how long they can go? No, I'm just kidding. Yeah. Well, right. We're talking about all right. they, it the is ball has not hit the ground yet. I know. I know. Oh, 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 I, oh. he jinxed him. Oh, he wow. jinxed him. Way to go, <laughs> Courtney. It. I got it. <laughs> Way to go, Courtney. Way to go, Courtney. You know, All right, wait, Lisa, friends. It is Chilton Middle School. Yes. A, uh, that's where Mrs. Stark teaches. And B, uh, I believe your photographer knows a thing or two wait, about volleyball. He does. Uh -huh. He does know a thing yeah. or two about volleyball. If we but I still have to drive with him for the next hour or so. Yeah, yeah look at him. Up. We get the picture but, right here. Look at that guy. Scott Holcomb and Dolphin Shorts yes, on the beach, baby. I, Shorts. Look at those shorts. <laughs> <laughs> He's still wearing shorts. They're a little longer. Oh, oh, lots of yelling. Wait, can we go? Can we go find Mrs. Stark? Yeah, go for it. She's got snacks in her room, so We're, go for okay. it. Okay. She's got. I couldn't be, go begin to her. tell you where I'm the room is. <laughs> when was the last time you were in her classroom? Perfect. All right, you guys. I'll send it back over to you. Thanks, Sue.